Hello everyone, I am back with another video and it is another haul video. I don't want to do like 100,000, I don't want my channel to be just a bunch of haul videos. And that's kind of one of the reasons why I wasn't filming for so long before because I couldn't really think of anything else creative to film. But I do have, I did, I've had these particular clothing items for a while now and I did want to film a haul with these particular clothes. So I'm going to just go ahead and do another haul video. Um, moving on, the actual haul. Um, so I bought a bunch of stuff from Gymshark. Um, and I'm going to just show you some of the pieces that I bought and how I, I've basically worn everything by this point. Some of the things, I've worn them more than once. Um, and I'm just going to tell you about how I feel about it. So I'm just trying to pull up the actual names of the pieces so I don't, so I'm telling you guys correctly. The first thing I'm going to show you is the Gymshark Legacy Fitness Bralette. Um, and I will link, if I can find them, if they still have these pieces, I will link them down below. If they don't, I'm sorry guys. I might try and find like similar pieces to them or something, but I will try to link everything down below. But it's just this little bralette. Um, and it has like the Gymshark logo situation picture stuff here. It's basically just a basic bra. I don't need like to be completely constricted. But I need some support to be able to, you know, jump up and down and do burpees and I hate burpees, but like, you know, you still have to do them. But this is just a nice basic bra. I'm, I love a good black bra, sports bra. I, that's my favorite because I just feel like neutral color, you can wear it with any top or anything like that. Um, I like how the straps are adjustable. Um, they do have like two straps here. Um, but that's that. It's a really basic, really simple, yet comfortable. The next bra I will show you is the Gymshark Turbo Seamless Sports Bra. And it's just this one here. I got it in like this black grayish color. Um, it's really basic. It has like a higher neck. And that is like the only issue I guess you could say that I have with this bra in particular is it does if you're not used to wearing something like close to your neck especially this is um compared to the legacy sports bra bralette whatever one that I just showed you guys this is a little like tighter and smugger I got all of this stuff in a size small um and one thing I will say is you don't have to wear it like this. It is shown like this and worn like this, but you could actually, it is uh, reversible or maybe not reversible, but like you could wear it backwards, essentially. I like, so if you are into, like if you really, really like having the pads, you can just move the pads on over to this side. So you could wear it like that, or if you just don't care about the pads, you could just take the pads out completely and just turn it over to this side if you don't like to be choked a little bit. So that's one thing that I did notice with some of those bras, they are like, you can flip them around, which is kind of nice. So you get like two bras in one. Gymshark Fit Sports Bra. Um, again, 
got a uh, black bra and this one is like basically like, it's just another basic sports bra it's like every sports bra you've ever seen and it just has the gymshark logo at the bottom at that band um it's just it's basic sports bra it's about medium support at least in my opinion You know, it works just like any other sports bra. There's not like anything like, oh my gosh about it. Um, but honestly, I like that about it. I, I, I like to keep things simple stupid um, for me personally. So I like this one. This is probably the one that I've worn the most. This next sports bra I'm going to show you is called the Gymshark Ultra Seamless Sports Bra. And it's another black one, of course. <laughs> Um, and this one is, it's interesting. I think I actually watched a few weeks ago a Clever video and they, um, where they were trying on different sports bras from different brands and companies and stuff at different price ranges. I think it was basically, and they tried Gymshark and Erin, I believe, wore this, basically the same sports bra, but it was in a blue color or something like that, and she hated it. And I kind of have to agree with her um, on how this little part goes. It kind of like chokes you, because like it's, I don't even know how to describe it. Like I was really confused on how to even put it on first, but basically you put it on like this, and so your neck is right like this, and so like this part right here basically chokes you. But, like I said, a lot of the sports bras that Gymshark has, you can flip it around. And so I wear it like this, and so it just has like the little straps like this, basically. Um, and so it just is strapped like this. And so that like uncomfortable part is actually behind you and not in front of you. It's still um, a little unusual basically but it's not like choking you and it's not as uncomfortable so that's how I wear this one and I think it's fine when I wear it like this this side I hate it this side I I'm fine with it I, it's a perfectly fine in sports bra so um that kind of gives you an idea and it does show you like in the picture they're wearing it this way um and not this way but unless you like being choked I would recommend wearing it this way um, but besides that, like choking hazard basically, I think it's actually a pretty good sports bra. Again, it's just like a, if you wear it this way, it's basically a basic sports bra, but it just has a little bit of extra detailing as far as like the straps and stuff. So, you know, if you're not that adventurous, you can just get that sports bra. Uh -huh. not necessarily a sports bra it's considered a crop top but to me I just think of it as a sports bra honestly um, and it's this one it is called the Gymshark Energy Plus seamless crop top but again like I said I kind of just consider this a sports bra in my personal opinion um, but I actually really like this it's like a um, mint kind of color mint greenish blue kind of color I don't think the camera's really showing it well but i actually really like this one because it's come down a little bit further and so i like that because you know this to me more coverage um i'm not like even though i i always like wear stuff especially if i'm actually going to a gym i definitely would wear a top i just i couldn't work out in just a sports bra like i'm just i need to be covered up a little bit um but if i'm home or something i'm fine just working out in a sports bra um but 
I do like that this one does come down a little bit more. So one day, maybe if I'm feeling confident, <laughs> I could maybe just strut out in this. Um, it's really simple and I really like the color. I wish I would have gotten the matching bottoms to this, but I didn't, um, in hindsight, you know. Next is literally the only matching thing I have, and it's these, um, bottoms, which are the Gymshark Flex Leggings and Dark Ruby, um, Marble Blush Nude. Crazy name. Um, and it's these. My one complaint with these is I feel like they're like more like low rise. Maybe, maybe they could pass as like mid rise, but they're kind of like low rise almost. And I'm a high rise kind of girl, especially when it comes to leggings. I, I know how to deal with like mid rise, so it's not like terrible to me. But like preference wise, I would have liked them to be high rise. Um, another little complaint that I have, and this is just all preference literally, because these leggings are fine. They're really comfortable. They're fine. Um, they work well as leggings. Their fabric is really nice and soft and like, but as, at the same time, like very, like structured and like, you know, the whole jam. And, but the only other complaint I have is they kind of, and a lot of Gymshark, um, leggings do this where they kind of like cup the butt situation. And when I bought them, I was like, let me give them a try. Um, you know, it looks good on all the little... Um, Insta or Instagram people, so let me give it a try. I don't really like it, but like I said again, like I'm not into like showing off my butt. I think they're comfortable and fine and everything, but I just wish they were high rise and maybe not showing off the butt as much. But these are really nice, and I also have the matching top to it. And the top is called um the Gymshark. Flex long sleeve crop top in dark ruby blah 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 blah. Um, I'll link these down below um, as long as I still have them. And it's this one, and this one actually does the same thing with like your boobs. Um, it kind of shapes them out, which I mean I don't really care as much with that because like I said I don't really have anything to show off anyways. The thing, the problem I have with the top is I probably would have gotten a medium if I would have known how tight this is. It literally like feels like I am like, I can never escape when I'm trying to take this off. It's like, <gasps> I can't get this off. I'm like, I'm struggling to get this off of me after a workout. I think it's really nice and like the concept of it is nice. It's just, I think I just need to have gotten a bigger size. Small is just too, too much for me. I mean, maybe I just should stick with like looser fitting gym shark tops and a little, yeah. That's my only complaint. I think it's really nice and really cute like as an outfit. Like to show you is the Gymshark Flex High-Waisted Leggings in Blue-Gray. These are basically essentially kind of the same thing, but I like these so much more. Um, the waistband is a little bit different. These are like a little bit, this waistband is a little bit softer, um, and I guess that's probably because it is high-waisted. I don't know. And then the booty showing off thing isn't as bad like it's not as noticeable i don't even think 
so you guys can see it a little bit so like it's it's not that noticeable it's not like a huge change of color like the um, ruby red ones are ruby blush ones I guess are actually um, and this one is high-waisted so I really like this one um, it's really nice again it's a fit to it it's, it's nice and snug and it's nice I think the fabric is really nice and everything and I think like for all of these they kind of hold up really nicely and really well I've worn this one multiple times but certainly not least, are the Gymshark Power Down Leggings in black, of course. These, I will say, are literally kind of like my favorite. I mean, for one, they're super basic. They're literally just all black. They have the little Gymshark logo at the bottom. But let me tell you, these things, they literally come up like to here to me. So I definitely always kind of like roll them down, which you can like so it's a very very versatile so you can wear it like if you feel very self-conscious about your stomach or something or you just feel more comfortable like having it all the way up you can have it all the way up you can have it um just like a regular high rise you can have it more mid rise or you could just literally have it all the way down if you really are into that <laughs> I really like these. I definitely would buy these little power down leggings again. Honestly, I would buy the other like the flex leggings again too. I just make sure I get high waisted, um, and I would definitely be into trying out other leggings. Um, but that's all I have to show you. That's all I got from Gymshark. I was kind of like my opinion and my take on Gymshark. And that's all I have for you guys today. I hope you did like and enjoy the video. You can always hit the like button if you did. You can also comment down below and you can also be great. It would be great if you subscribe to my channel for more content from me. Um, I hope you all have a nice day. Catch you later. Bye.